Alright guys, hey what's up? Um, right now we're going to be doing a network speed comparison test between test number one and test number two which would be um, a computer directly connected to your router which would be then directly connected to your modem. And we're going to compare speeds there, we're going to do a speed test and then what we're going to do on the second test is we're going to bypass our router completely. Uh, we're going to directly connect our computer to our modem so instead of instead of in the in the port for the modem instead of connecting the router we're just gonna directly connect our ethernet cable and we're gonna see what happens so right now we're gonna do test number one which is computer to router to modem and on both of these tests I am the only one using this uh, network I'm the only one using the router right now okay so I've disabled wireless on the router I uh, have also only set it to, yeah so I disabled wireless and I'm the only one using the connection right now and using the router right now so basically my theory is that the depending on what router you have it can uh, either increase or decrease it can greatly or just m like minimal effects on your internet connection so without further ado we're gonna test so this is testing our down our ping is 15 milliseconds and this is the direct connection from our computer to router to modem and right here we just got 10.37 megabytes per second we're testing our upload now and we're just hitting about one so that's okay but really what we're paying the service for right now for our cable internet is uh, 15 down and one up so you know for me that's okay I mean I can get by on that that's pretty good speeds for me but I mean what about those five other megabytes per second right so we're gonna completely bypass our router so as you can see we're directly connected right here I'm gonna follow that cable up runs all the way here into the back of our router like so so we're gonna open this and here's our modem and here is the cable that plugs into the back of the modem which would plug into the router and then I'd plug my devices in there but my theory is that the router slows down my internet because of some odd reason and plus the fact that we just had this router for so long Ugh. sorry guys it's hard to do with one hand get out jeez okay there's a cable and here is our ethernet cable that is directly connected to our laptop and we're just gonna replace it okay so that's good we've directly disconnected our router from our modem And now we're going to do test two, which is a direct connection from our laptop or computer to our modem and directly connected to our cable line. So we're just gonna wait a bit until the connection gets up. F5. F5, there we go. So some conclusions you can make from this test is either, uh, in my case, I need a new router. So, you know, I've, I've run this test for about five times before I actually made this video. And there you go. That's just about 15 down, guys. I mean, that is what I want. That is the speeds that I want because I mean that's what we're paying for right we're paying for 15 down and one up so I don't know guys you make the judge we also lowered our ping 
by just a little bit. And I don't know guys, you can draw your own conclusions. My conclusion, I need a new router. So an FYI, that router is about four years old. <laughs> so um, you know, take what you will, assume what you will. So guys, see you later.